The odds of success without planning, as as you just said, Ed, without without that, are, are very slim, right? You're you're you're, you're if if you have a, a compass, right, from where you are today and where you want to be, and and you, and, and and you understand, you know, where the end goal is, and and the and the and you know the roadmap along the way, you might veer off a little bit, but you're going to get back on course compared to not having that, right? I mean, compared to not having any type of uh, compass and and, and direction. Um, you're going to struggle, right? And, and you, you know, we see this. I see this in my own life. I see this in anybody's life. Any friends of mine, where you don't have some focus on on, on what you want to be or where you're going, you're gonna you're gonna wander a lot, and you're going to be off course a lot, right? Compared to, you know, the vision you've had and the and the and the roadmap you've created yourself, and you continue to. Um, so it, it, a, a small percentage of people in this world actually have that that roadmap right laid out. And, and not that it's a, it's a rigid roadmap. It can change. It, you, know, you can pivot off it, right? Um, but when you have it, right, success will come a lot easier. I, I yeah, believe. I completely agree with that. So we start off with the vision. Where do you want to be? Where do you want the company to be? Where do you want to be as a father? Where do you want to be as a person? Once you start with that vision and that's out in front of you, your goals may, like you say, you may change, you may adapt a little bit, but eventually you want to get to that vision. And mm-hmm. that's what's so important. A lot of people don't have that. We have that at the header of every one of our executive meetings. This is our vision. Mm-hmm. By 2025, we want to be this size company, and it's pretty granular, but it's concise. Sure. And we talk about that, and that's at the front. We, we repeat that at the beginning of every meeting, so we know where we're going. Now, again, the goals may change, and outside circumstances may change, and occasionally the vision may change, but generally it's it's been consistent vision of what we want to be. And, and and like you're saying, so so many so many people we know that are, that are successful have that, right? They have a vision. They they get their team members to buy into the vision, and they have a roadmap that's that's agreed upon with with their team. Um, and once in a while, like we say, they they may pivot here or there, but overall, they they reach those goals. And and some of our our our, our best friends in life actually do that with their with their family as well, right? They do it great with their family also. Now now you're now you're hitting on both you know cylinders when it comes to you know, business and family, which is even even more uncommon, right? Um, but but uh, some people we, I know do that super, super well, and, and some don't.